Hi, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial series I'll be showing you how you can work with the rack and pinion mechanism in the KTW5 in the DMU Kinematics Workbench. So right here in front of us we have the information dialog box which says the mechanism can be simulated. So once you reach at this particular stage, the next step is to insert a simulation. So I'll click on the simulation right here and I'll, uh, you, can, you will get a dialog box which uh, states that you need to show the software which particular mechanism you want to simulate. So this particular dialog box comes because uh, in the case where you have a number of mechanisms and you need to simulate one of them, you have the option of selecting that. So right here you don't have any other mechanisms so you need to select mechanism 1 as you can see here and just click on OK and you have the option over here uh, to move the slider and you can see that uh, the uh, particular uh, rack and pinion rotates so uh, you can see basically this rotates and uh, what you can do right now is keep on the position where you want to insert the first point insert and uh, what you can do now is click over here and uh, just modify and again what you can do is put it in this position insert so basically what you can do right now is just play it you can reduce the velocity and uh, you can play it right here so uh, this is uh, how you can do the basic simulation in the KTRV5 uh, of rack and pinion so uh, this tutorial series completes the uh, uh, designing the designing from the scratch of each and every part of this particular uh, basic rack and pinion mechanism and again insertion of uh, some joints and fixing parts and everything and uh, finally the simulation so keep watching to learn more thank you